So you guys decided to shoot a movie. After, uh, after a couple of years, you decided to turn the series into a movie. Why? Why is this a movie? Why does it need to be a movie instead of another season of the show? You know what, the, the show, for me, you know, I'll jump in, it's Doug. The show was uh, always a very cinematic show, you know, and uh, we would see it at premieres at giant theaters, and we'd always go, wow, we'd love to see this with a big group, and we always knew people were getting together and watching in big groups, so we thought that uh, this was the right way to see it, so uh, I think, we think we made a big movie that people like in the theater. Yeah, I think we all thought there was more left to do with the characters, and uh, it's something weird happened. I don't know when it happened, but as soon as we wrapped the show, the questions of when is the movie happening, it's almost like a Jedi mind trick. Like, we've talked about it, but then we didn't put it out there in the world necessarily, and then we started getting these questions of you doing a movie, and it's like, yeah. We're gonna. And, and also, Wahlberg would keep calling saying every press junket for every movie he would do, they would ask, where's the movie, where's the movie? And, and so, so few um, TV shows uh, have had successful runs and gone on to do movies, so uh, that in itself was a challenge that we were up to. Was Russell any good? Be well, honest. Yeah. No. Man. Uh, that sounds <laughs> like a not very right. honest yeah. Natural no, Russell. Yeah. No, Russell, <laughs> Russell was very natural, but I mean, listen. I, I would definitely think he should keep the day job. Obviously, it's more, it's more worth more money. But Who was Russell better? Was fantastic. Russell on set, or you trying to catch those tennis balls? I was going to say, I don't think, I don't think I should quit my day job either. <laughs> right. No, Russell has been so gracious and wonderful to us on so many different levels. It's, it's, it's the, the guy. You know, good things happen to good people, and you, you know, it's uh, no one, no wonder why he's so successful. Other athletes you guys met over the course of doing this. I mean, you had a lot of scenes with the Lakers, etc. Who are some of the other athletes you guys came? across who did you who were you impressed by well you know we had Gronk on the set which is cool and Julian Edelman and uh yeah, it's amazing we, to be talking about yeah that. those guys are not yeah. cool yeah. yeah who else yeah, you got they were fun they were fun <laughs> I mean we got I won't mention Brady <laughs> Baron Davis and who else is you know Ronda Rousey. Ronda Rousey, you know, who's on the cover of sports. Yeah, so I've seen some of those scenes with you and Ronda Rousey. So she kind of she takes it to you a little bit. I mean, that's what we show in the trailer. But when you see the movie, spoiler alert, I win. <laughs> <laughs> that's a lie, guys. That's a lie. Everyone listen. Yeah. By the way, Jerry so badly wants to get into sports radio, or he actually wants to intern for the Seahawks as GM. So we we were going to put that to Pete. You and Josh later. Schneider have some similarities. You're about the. I mean, there's a, your same size. You kind of have the same vibe going. Jerry, you did say it to Pete Carroll last night. He kind of threw it at him last night. I would I, like to intern GM, and Pete kind of was like, ha ha. <laughs> I don't think he knew I was dead serious, and I would, I would hang it all up right now to be in some kind of internship program to be groomed as a GM. Do you have the there. chops for that? Absolutely. And what? What? Why do you say that? What gives because you? Because what else am I supposed to say? No. <laughs> He's I think confident. I, that's, my yeah. chops are. I knew to answer that question and say absolutely. Yeah, that's a, that's that's rule number one. Moneyball. We play moneyball. Moneyball. <laughs> I, I also I also tried to show off my arm to Pete Carroll looking for a bit of a compliment and it just wasn't happening. And sure. Connolly has a, I have to say, Connolly has a good arm. He could throw. Of the group, if we were to pick our quarterback, oh. Oh, really? it's yeah. a no doubt. Oh. Connolly's yeah, I'm throwing. The, I'm the star. Uh, well, Who we'll can catch? Right. <laughs> Hold on. Here's a real break. question. Uh, Who can catch? Because I've tried to catch it when, when Brock throws it. So Brock retired from the NFL in 2006. Oh, right? something like that. And Brock, <laughs> Brock was, still has a cannon. Right. I can him. imagine that. I have tried, right next I've him. tried to catch it, and it injured my fingers to the point where I will never do it again. Yeah, that's how it is. Which of you guys would be able to catch a ball from Brock? Well, I, I could catch him. Here's oh, what I know. Yeah, fire oh, 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 fire from man. what distance? Oh, let's go do this. Uh, let's not, go too go close. Right. not too close. Let's go on the parking lot. But do you want him to catch it? Are you wanting him to yeah. catch it? Yeah, I'll, 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 I'll go 60%. I'll uh, kind of crank it up. Like you want to do, like you, if you were throwing I know you got other appearances. I'm not going to bust the face. We're going outside. I like my hands, but how hard is the ball going to be? It's hard. It's only the ball. It's the inflation. It's 14 pitches. Actually, Marino autographed this ball. So it's a Marino autograph. This is perfect. Oh, yeah, we do. God, this is what we do. All right. We got to run. I can sling this. Thing. That thing? Is okay. that the real one? This yes, is, hold on, let me see this. Sling that thing. Oh, that's real. Oh, this one's, feel, this one's it, actually it, that not that inflated. Like that that one, is, you gotta get one that's this more than that. Ball <laughs> it sure. really, really hurts. All right, movie comes out June 3rd. June 3rd, Wednesday, excuse June 3rd. me. Wednesday, June 3rd. So go see the Entourage movie. Thanks to all these guys for coming in. Kevin Connolly, Kevin Dillon, Jerry Ferreira, Doug Elon as well. Thank you guys. We really appreciate it. We're sending you out to the parking lot right now with right the Thank you very much. Well, there it comes. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, all right. It's the release. Oh, I think I'm ready for that. About fifty. All right, here we go. Oh, man, I'm coming up here. Oh, man, you can see a finger going. You're going to break a finger.
Whoa, Charlie! It was Marsha Brady there. Come on! Oh, oh, get those hands up there! Get those hands up! Marsha Brady! There you go! Over. You know what it is? We're not used to that. Hey, man, we're going to be skipping it in there. Rock, you say you're a left guy. By the way, how long are you having now? You guys aren't used to seeing it come from the left. Damn, is that coming hot? Thank you, guys.